Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. Today we are going to fix slow performance of Windows 10, especially after update. If your system is lagging, especially after update, this video is for you. We will be doing five simple steps in order to fix the problem and make sure you watch the whole video. So let's get started. Just do a right click on the start icon and click on run. You can also press window and R key together. Now, once you do that, you will find a run window. And here we need to type services.msc and hit OK. Now, the moment you do it, a new window will appear very soon. I'll just maximize it. Now, here all the services are there, which is running. So just select B and look for background intelligent transfer service. Once you find it, do a right click and click on stop. Now, once this is done, press W. Now, here we are looking for Windows Update. So, I'll scroll it down and I have found the Windows Update. I'll just do a right click and I'll click on stop. Two steps have been performed. Now, we will move to the third step. And for that, I'll mention these commands in the description box. So you can copy it and you just need to go to search bar, type CMD and run as an administrator. Once you do that, it will ask you to say yes. So just copy that command and here, paste it here by pressing Control V or you can simply do a right click on this and it will be pasted. Once you type it, hit enter and do the same thing for the second one. The second command is also there. My Windows is installed in C drive. This is why in the command, the C drive is selected. So if you have installed your Windows on D drive or any other drive, you can replace that. Else, just copy it. If you have Windows in your C drive, that's fine. And here, I'll just do a right click and it's, see it's pasted. And I'll hit enter. So it will take a second to process this command. And once this is done, we will move to the final and the last step. And after that, you need to restart the computer. All right. So here in the search type troubleshoot and click on troubleshoot settings. Let me maximize it. Now here, look for additional troubleshooters. Now look for Windows update. Click on that. It will ask you to run the troubleshooter. So click on that. It will start detecting problem. And once this diagnostic and scan is done, restart the computer and see if your computer is running better or not. Let me know in the comment section if it has worked for you. And please hit the like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day.